For some reason, my Pinterest feed will not stop serving me this weird hat bodysuit thing. So today we're trying it. Whoa. Oh, they're actually separate? I feel lied to. <laughs> This feels like a Fortnite skin. Wow. <laughs> it's exactly like the picture. Is it worth $150? I don't know. Well, I scratched that itch. <laughs> We've ordered lots of unrealistic Pinterest outfits in past videos, and today we're accessorizing them with everything from hair accessories to shoes. Hair accessories are making a huge comeback. I feel like I haven't seen this many hair accessories since like the early 2000s, and I'm here for it. This particular one really caught my eye. It's cool for a wedding or a special event or just, you know, day to day. <laughs> it's really pretty if we can actually realistically get this look with this product. $39. Let's try it. I'm afraid that she has like five of these tassels in her hair. We'll see though. That's what I was afraid of. It only comes with three strands of pearls. I paid $36 for this. $39 actually. And it's because it's a wedding accessory website and anything wedding for some reason is always marked up like six times what it's actually worth. Oh no. The clip is straight up broken. Well, it would have been cute. Unrealistic. The more Pinterest videos I do like this, the weirder my Pinterest feed gets. And that's especially apparent with the shoes that I've been getting suggested. Uh, in particular, these ones. Donut Heels 2.0. There was a 1.0 of these. <laughs> From Shoe Bakery. They are $300. Look at these. Even the actual shoe itself literally looks like bread. That is impressive. The sprinkles, the frosting. It's an option to have the donut on the heel. Of course we want that. <laughs> I like this disclaimer. This product is not edible. <laughs> I'm so excited for these. Um, I am a bit concerned that there's only one photo on the website. That's usually not a good sign, but the donut heels are here. Something sounds loose in here. I hope something's not broken. Oh, good news. I think it was just this tiny card rolling around. Wow, they're everything I hoped they would be. Look at them. And then the donut is actually foam, which is cool. Like it looks like cake. That doesn't smell like cake. <laughs> I love these. I'm wearing these somewhere. I even got a real donut to compare it to. Okay, side by side moment. That is ridiculous. Literally the donut on the shoe looks, looks better cool. than a real donut. Bling gloves with nails. Rhinestone gloves, bedazzled sparkly gloves. <laughs> Look how pretty these are. And they even have like fake nails on the end of them. Sounds familiar actually. <laughs> Look at them. These are literally like my favorite Halloween purchase of all time, which is perfect for me because as you can tell, I'm not very good at remembering to do my nails. So if I can just have gloves that have them built in, $69 kind of seems like a lot for these, but if they're handmade, Oh, wow. Here we go. Yes, they fit so well. We did a lot of tugging and pulling to get these on and the stones all held up on the gloves, which is impressive. So far, this is a pretty realistic Pinterest haul. Not practical probably, <laughs> but so pretty. Speaking of impractical, I found the ultimate jacket to wear to any family event that is sure to drive any dad or grandpa absolutely bonkers. And it's this denim jacket. <laughs> I think it's kind of cool. So useless as far as jackets go, but kind of cool. It's $100 from the store, Sensual Ambition. I feel like this is probably not worth $104. They just marked it up as such. I feel like with the right outfit, it could be pretty cool. Or it could be cheap and terrible. We're about to find out. Well, so far I feel like I maybe got duped and spent $100 on a jacket that's worth like 20. Like there's hardly any fabric. Why did it cost so much? Okay, I think this goes in here. This goes in here. Why is this so hard to put on? It's so pointless, I love it. I mean, this is like a weird outfit to wear it with. With a different outfit, I think it's a cool accessory. It's basically like arm sleeves. It's fashion. One time when I was perusing the internet, I found these high heel roller skates. <laughs> Looks like a literal death trap, but I thought I need those in my life. Finally, my Pinterest feed came through and suggested these to me. Impala Marawa high heel skates. <laughs> it's sparkle orange. They even have the sparkle gloves. I feel targeted in the best way. We're gonna be dangerous in style. This is such a high heel 
on wheels. $279 though. I don't know, what do like a nice pair of roller skates cost? Probably kind of close to that. No, literally like half that. <gasps> Light up orange sparkle wheels. As if these couldn't get any better. <laughs> Wait, it's an actual roller skater that designed these. So that means they have to be functional, right? <laughs> 12 world records. You go, Marwa. I've never been so excited for something so dangerous. Oh, the packaging's even cute. <gasps> Yeah, they're so pretty. Look at that glitter. Okay, we gotta figure out how the wheels light up. I see lights in them. How do you turn them on though? Okay, how long do we give it before I face plant? Look how pretty they are though. I'm up, I'm up. These are treacherous. Here I go, woo I'm skating, guys, woo! Around this time, we figured out that the lights turn on just by the wheels rolling. Oh, they're Whoa. kind of bright. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. We can't talk about Pinterest accessories without talking about wigs. This one really stood out to me though. Look at the color. This long blonde and then this kind of like tie-dye blue on the other side. I love it. I mean, I don't think that really comes as a surprise, but uh, Wet Kiss is the brand, I guess. <laughs> I went to their website and I searched and searched and this particular wig is nowhere to be found. They really only have like natural colors of hair. I feel like it was a bit of false advertising. <laughs> the prices of these wigs are really good for actual human and hair, so I kind of want to try them anyway, just to see if they're legit. Oh my gosh, it smells so bad. I don't know anything about wigs. I just wanted to see if you can get a legitimate wig of this length, human hair quality, for 200 bucks. What in the, what is this? What? What the heck is that? Um, well, they just threw in a bonus one for you. Okay. I ordered this, I think. Lace front, 18 inches, and this was the closest thing that they had to a fun color. Oh, it's kind of, it doesn't look like 18 inches. I mean, it feels really nice though, actually. Okay, I'll try this one on if you try this one on. Deal. Okay, Tyler, put your wig cap on. I don't need a wig cap, I don't have any hair. <laughs> this is so weird. I haven't had brown hair in years. What do we think? <laughs> Apparently this was a free gift that came with our order. Mine wasn't a bad wig, but it also doesn't really look like the pictures I was advertised and definitely doesn't look like the pin. Next I got a couple of sparkly things, but I was pretty disappointed in both of them to say the least. They just didn't fit right. This one just isn't cool. Someone's gonna have to line up. Like off. individually place them. Now they made it look a lot easier in the video. And I'm really excited about the next product, so we're just gonna speed on. My Pinterest really, really wanted me to see these shoes. They are incredible in the most adorable, morbid, strange way. Um, $264, unfortunately, they're literally sold out everywhere. In fact, I feel like they had been selling for a lot more than $264, but I can't even find them secondhand anywhere. So, I'm gonna try to make my own. <laughs> Let's go DIY ho. I found these clear shoes on eBay. They're a little bit different, but kind of the same idea for $80. And a whole bunch of Barbies. Okay, I really hope that these shoes open. Not really something I double checked, I just assumed. Oh, this is the coolest thing ever. The way to put the stuff in the shoe is the sole comes out and there's a secret compartment. There's like endless opportunities of things that we can put in these. Water and fish, not real fish. Yeah, real goldfish. <laughs> I feel like Sid from Toy Story right now. <laughs> Murderer! I mean, they pop right back on. Is the head gonna fit in the shoe? Oh, she can totally fit. I just don't know how I'm gonna like get them to where I want them to go, you know? Move! <laughs> Oh no! 
That'll be $300. I just don't think I'm gonna be able to place them perfectly. I mean, it was worth an experimental try. I think maybe I should pop these heads back on and donate these Barbies. <laughs> Look at this. Another item that I have no idea what business I have wearing this anywhere, but I love it. Um, it's on Etsy, it says it's unavailable, but don't worry, we ordered it. This thing is heavy. Wow. It looks pretty much exactly like what I was promised. Let's try it on. <gasps> I'm obsessed with it. Like you could just wear it with like a simple dress, but it would totally transform the look. Kind of reminds me of that custom TikTok body chandelier thing that I bought, but significantly less money. This is absolutely worth $70. Time for the accessory that started it all, inspired this whole video. This wig. Look at this thing. It looks heavy. It's like a wig made entirely out of tennis bracelets, basically. It, look at it. <sighs> I need it. Um, the problem is there was no website attached to this one, so I dug. I searched the entire internet, and the closest thing I could find is this Ice Queen wig on Etsy. It's not quite as long, as you can see, and it doesn't look quite as full as the one on Pinterest, but it's $500. <laughs> so I can't imagine what the actual full-length Pinterest one costs. The most expensive thing from the whole video. I hope it's worth it. It's heavy. <laughs> oh, it's pretty long actually. It feels so cool. Sparkly wig ASMR. Here we go. Tyler, I might need help with this one. It's just so heavy. Oh my gosh. You look amazing. This is so cool. You don't even look like real. You look like AI. <gasps> yes! Now it really doesn't look real. I feel like I need a different outfit. Oh, I know just the outfit. Here's the look <laughs> with the infamous silver Pinterest pants and the shoes. <laughs> I look like I'm about to perform something. I don't know what. What does it look like from the back? Not the pants, the hair. <laughs> Make sure to check out our unrealistic Pinterest outfits and dresses videos if you haven't seen those yet. Enjoy the next video.